welcome to maths is easy hello friends as there is always a need of help in calculating or solving mathematics question on different levels i am here for the same today in this video i am going to solve chapter factorization of algebraic expressions xi 7.5 question number 3 so if you guys want to see the solutions of earlier chapters like rational numbers exponent square and square roots cube and cube roots algebraic expressions factorization of algebraic expressions earlier exercises and quadrilaterals playing with numbers you can go by the playlist where all the solutions are given so let's not to waste further time check it out how to solve question number 3 of exercise 7.5 so here in question number 3 exercise 7.5 we have to do the division of algebraic expressions so the first part is x square plus 4x minus 21 divided by x minus 3 so how will we do it first of all we would write x square plus 4x minus 21 divided by x minus 3 so in our next step we would split it x square plus 7x minus 3x minus 21 divided by x minus 3 so here we would take the factors now so common x plus 7 and in here we would take minus 3 as common so again we will be left with x plus 7 by x minus 3 so in our next step our factors will be coming out as as x minus 3 x plus 7 divided by x minus 3 so this x minus 3 will get cancelled with this x minus 3 and we would be left with x plus 7 which will be our answer hope the question is clear if any type of doubt is there you can ask me by commenting into the comment box so let's come to the next part so next part of question number 3 is m square plus 21 m minus 46 divided by m minus 2 so in here in our next step we would write m square Plus twenty one m minus forty six divided by m minus two. In our next step, we would split it, and we would split it like m square plus twenty three m minus two m minus forty six divided by m minus So here we will take common m plus twenty three, and here minus two will be taken as common. So we will be left with m plus twenty three divided by m minus two. In our next step, we will be left with m plus twenty three. M minus two divided by M minus two. So this M minus two will get cancelled with this M minus two, and we will be left with M plus twenty three as a. Hope the question is clear. If still any type of doubt is there, you can ask me by commenting into the comment box. Now. Come to the third part. 
So third part of question number three, x size 7.5 says x square minus 11x plus 30 by x minus 5. So in our next step, we would write x square minus 11x plus 30 by x minus 5. So split it x square minus 6x minus 5x plus 30 by x minus 5. So in our next step, we will take common x minus 6 minus 5 x minus 6. So we will be in our denominator we would write x minus 5 in our next step x minus 6 x minus 5 divided by x minus 5. So this will get cancelled with this and we will be left with x minus 6 as a Have a full glance of third part of question number 3 of exercise 7.5. Now come to the fourth part. So fourth part is 6x squared minus 51x plus 55 by 2x minus 7. So how will we do it? We will do it like this. We will write 6x square minus 31x plus 35 divided by 2x minus 7. So in our first step, we need 6. So 2 into 3, 3 will be there and x squared. So it will go by 3x. So here we would write 6x squared minus 21x. Now we will change the sign. This will get cancelled and this will be coming out as minus 10x plus. Now we need minus 10x. So it will go by minus 5 only. So it will be coming out as minus 10x plus 35. We will change the sign. It will get cancelled and it will also get cancelled. So nothing is left. So our answer would become or we can say our quotient would become 3x minus 5 which is our answer. Hope the fourth part is clear. Have a full glance of fourth part of exercise 7.5, question number three. Now come to the last two parts, which are fifth part and sixth part. Now come to the fifth part. Fifth part says 2x square plus 11x plus 5 by 2x plus 1. So we will write like this. 2x square plus 11x plus 5 divided by 2x plus 1. So it will go by x only. So here we would write 
2x square plus x. We will change the sign. So it will get cancelled and it will be coming out as tan x plus 5. Now it will go by plus 5 only. So here tan x would be there and plus would be there. We will change the sign now. They both get answered. So here the answer of fifth part is x plus 5. So you can say the question is x plus 5. Have a full glance of fifth part. Of question number three, exercise seven point five. Now come to the last part, which is the sixth part of question number three. So sixth part says x cube minus five x square minus two x plus twenty four by x minus 4. So we will write like this. x cube minus 5x square minus 2x plus 24 by x minus 4. So it will go by x square. So it will be coming out as x cube minus 4x square. So we will change the sign now. We'll get cancelled. And it will be coming out as minus x square minus 2x plus 24. Now it will go by minus x only. So here it will be coming out as minus x square plus 4x. Again, we will change the sign. It will get cancelled and it will minus 6x plus 20. Now, it will go by minus 6 only. So, it will be coming out as minus 6x plus 24. Change the sign again and it will get So the answer or you can say the question of sixth part of question number three exercise 7.5 is x square minus x minus x. Hope all the questions are clear. Feel free to ask if there is any doubt by commenting into the comment box. So in my next video, I will be solving quadrilaterals exercise. Last exercise, which is I think the exercise 12.3. So if you guys like my videos or if it is somewhere helpful to you, kindly subscribe to my channel, hit the like button and share the videos as much as possible. Thank you so much.